Hello everyone, uh, welcome to my YouTube channel. This is Jay Prakash. Uh, this is Big Data Hands on Training and today we are going to see how to uh, actually transfer the data between multiple uh, Big Data eco ecosystem tools like uh, Big and Hive and uh, we have to use uh, HCAT Loader and HCAT Storer to you know move the data between multiple Big Data ecosystem tools. So we created a multiple table. I created multiple tables in Hive, and I have you know processed my data now. My requirement is to uh, import into Pig and do some more for you know further analytics. So how to do it? Let's quickly see. So I'm going to my. I'm invoking my Pig using use minus use h catalog. So you have to invoke your pig using this minus uh, use hcat log. This is what you need to do. Okay. So no, it's not working. Okay. This is what you need to do. Hit and enter. It will invoke your pig in head. You know hcat log mode. So let's quickly go on to your hive. I will cover what is Hive later, but let's see. There is something called Hive where you can create your tables and you can do analytics. Uh, you know, similar kind of SQL kind of analytics you can do. Uh, Hive contains high query language, uh, which is very similar to SQL, and uh, we can do our analytics on top of Hive. You know, create uh, multiple tables, uh, normalized tables. We can do join subqueries and everything. So. Let me show the databases in Hive. As of now, I do have these many databases. So let me use a uh, retail underscore stage. Let me show tables. We have these many tables. So I'm going to select uh, start from products. For a change, let's use products and I do have a lot of data and let me see the schema so this is the schema of our products table in Hive so how to get this table into pick it is in Hive so how to do it no uh, no need of you know thinking much so we invoked in hcatalog mode so that we can share the resources among different big data ecosystem tools so in pig um, as usual load in colon database name retail underscore stage dot uh, products using and this is what you need to remember or dot apache dot hive hcatalog dot pig dot hcat loader so you need to uh, uh, using this hcat loader you have to load your uh, uh, a bag so it will load it has loaded and uh, let's describe a so we get the schema so this is the schema of that it is having avro schema because your pig it is an avro schema it has been created with avro file format which is nothing but json so I'm not going to do much manipulation. Uh, uh, what I'm going to do is uh, for each a generate uh, product ID, and I'll just pick up the product ID and product name. ID comma product name. So it is generated, there is no issues created. So let me dump B and as usual it will submit a map reduce job. So it will submit and uh, it will execute a map reduce job. And let's see the output. it is a single node cluster it is taking some time but in real-time environment your Hadoop programs 
will be executing in a multi node cluster so we got the output so this is it so this is for this video so we have seen how to um, load the data into pig from your high tables using hcat loader so similarly there is something called hcat storer so from pig we can load directly into your hbase or hive or whatever it is so uh, this is it for this video and uh, we can see uh, some other topic in my some other video and uh, if you like this video please like uh, and you know share it to your friends and most importantly please subscribe thank you so much